Hey guys, I check everything here from gumboltech.com and johnsiphone.com and today I have a very nice guide and how to tutorial on how to set up your iPhone to make it look like a Windows Phone 7 phone. Now this is a simpler um, guide that I'm going to show you. Later on in the week I'll be um, uploading a video on how to make it look more complex and uh, it's a harder way um, on setting your iPhone to look like a Windows Phone. So right now this is the simpler version and all it takes is one activation and uh, few little tweaks here and there and here we go so this this is the first theme I like to show you guys this is the lock screen this is the Windows Phone 7 lock screen which are um, which is available in Cydia for free I will show you guys that later on when I show you all the packages you have to download in Cydia but right now this is the Windows Phone 7 lock screen as you can see it's very nice um, you can set your own default uh, wallpaper and the bottom is very similar to Windows Phone tells you the time the day and the date just like in Windows Phone, very nice UI right there. But it doesn't tell you notifications at the bottom. You gotta get like lock info for that. But I prefer not having notifications at the bottom anyway. So that's the lock screen. Now, if if you notice, I slide I slide it up to um unlock my iPhone. That's the way the Windows Phone Seven goes. And uh, that tweak is called custom slide, which allows you to customize how the, the way you unlock your iPhone, whether you want it to be the normal slide to unlock or you can slide vertically up or any other different styles there and uh, I'll show you guys that in a second on Cydia and the settings so and I'm gonna lock my iPhone and this is Windows Phone 7 the UI and graphic elements are all um, in this this is not <clears throat> sorry about that you can see that um, it's a very nice theme it doesn't have animated live tiles the animated live tiles are coming in my second part of this guide, which is the uh, the more complicated version of this. And uh, you can see it looks very nice, very similar to the Windows Phone 7. They are really large tiles, small tiles, comes with different kind of sizes. And uh, you can change the color of this, you can change whether you want it in 12-hour um, format, 24-hour format, degrees Celsius, degrees Fahrenheit for your weather widget. Depends on which news reader you want, I prefer Pulse. And uh, you can choose to which color of which color tiles you want. I like this kind of blue, and, um, and voila, it changes within just a tap. And that's your news reader right there. You can see it changed a while ago. And it's all default apps that you get when you uh, download this theme. It is a Dreamboard theme. It's available at the theme store, which I'll show you later. And when you press the info tab, it gives you a nice little info widget right there. But you can access your phone, messages, mail, and app store, and a nice weather widget there for you. For a quick look, and there's all your uh, apps listed in like a nice little Android style format. Um, the layout of the icons are based on your theme you have on your iOS version. So right now I currently have Impulse. It's a theme in Studio which you can find uh, to set my icons to look like this. And but uh, if you have a theme installed, these are the custom icons you get, like the app store icon right there and. Uh, the mail, these are all default Windows Phone apps, and you can see the UI on the top, little nice apps logo there. It looks very similar to the Windows Phone 7 kind of style. So, you can see you can launch any app from here. I just launched my clock right there with just a single tap. This doesn't have the Windows Phone kind of 7 apps, just launch into the iOS apps right away, and uh, it is very nice indeed. So, let me go ahead and show you the packages that are involved to set this up. Let's go ahead and look at the lock screen first. I'm going to launch Cydia. And, uh, cancel right there. And, so, the lock screen is called Windows Phone 7 lock screen right there 
That's the exact title, Windows Phone 7 Lock Screen. The author goes by the name of Jankam110, version 1.0. And you can go ahead and find the studio under the Mod My Eye repo. Style Unlock. It's a version 1.2 which allows you to activate or uh, unlock your phone uh, and uh, using any gesture you want uh, or the presets involved in this. And it's available under the Big Boss repo version 1.2 and it is free. Next one is available under the Themit store. You have to download the Themit app first which is under the Themit repo. And once you download that, you can purchase any themes from the Themit app. And one of the themes I, I, I purchased was um, this theme. It's called Metro Dreamboard. It's a very nice theme that allow you to I just showed you what, uh, what, 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 what ah, I just showed you what you could do with this theme. Uh, make it look, make your iPhone look like a Windows Phone 7 phone. Very nice. And uh, let's wait for it to load first. And I'm gonna go ahead and look at my themes. Um, all themes right here. And from Metro, where are you? L M N right there. Should be somewhere here. There you go, Metro Dreamboard. The author goes by now Rigatone, one Rigatoni, whatever. And uh, no setup required, just requires the app Dreamboard, which I'll show you in a bit. All the screenshots here, and. Uh, you can see that I officially purchased this theme. I didn't pirate it via Cydia. Managed theme at the bottom right there. And uh, that's basically it for the Metro Dreamboard theme itself. And to activate this theme, you gotta go ahead and download Dreamboard from Cydia. You spell it Dreamboard, and you can find it on Cydia. And uh, I'm not gonna go ahead and show you on Cydia anymore because it's really easy to find. Dreamboard, one word. And uh, once you download that, to activate this theme, you gotta go ahead. And Launch the Dreamboard app on your iOS. Go back here. Let me show you the iOS version. Um, Dreamboard right there. It is free. Then you're gonna go ahead and download Metro. And once you download the Metro theme, like in the theme store, I'll well, go ahead and tap Metro, and it should load up as easy as that. Very simple, guys. Um, it's basically my easy, uh, complex sort of complex guide on how to set up Windows Phone 7 on your iPhone. This is not really like the whole OS, it's just a simpler version. I'll go to the more complicated version, like I said like two times a while ago, um, later on this week. So stay tuned, stay tuned for that. Um, subscribe more for some more how-to guides. Uh, I do a lot of how-to how <laughs> I do a lot of how-to guides like this. And uh, I know I've not been doing a lot of these uh, lately. Too many reviews to catch up on, I'm sorry about that guys. And uh, go ahead and follow me on Twitter at program hacker 92 again if you have any questions regarding this team go ahead and contact the developer at rigatone one on Twitter or um, contact me via YouTube or Twitter or um, leave your comments in the section below and uh, I'll get back to you ASAP if I can I'm very busy these days school started so please do not expect a reply but just comment and I might reply so anyway guys this is the end of this video um, keep on watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.